Hey everyone, he's going to be question on comparing the ratios. The question is compare the ratio 5 to 12 and 3 is to 8. So there are many ways of doing it. So let me write down the ratios first. So the first ratio here is 5 is to 12 and second ratio is 3 is to 8. Now how to compare? I hope you all learned how to compare the fractions, right? And you also know that ratios can be written in a fractional form. So 5 is to 12 will be equal to 5 by 12 and 3 is to 8 is equal to 3 by 8. Now there are two ways, one is I feel like a longer one where you have to make denominator same like you have learned how to compare the fractions right. If the denominators are same we can compare the numerators and the numerator which is greater that fraction is greater. Same technique we are going to apply for this one but I feel that method is little bit lengthy but you can do that method also you have to take the LCM of 12 and 8 make the denominator same and then do it. But the best way I'll do it, like I'm going to explain you is, it's called cross multiplication. Just cross multiply and then you can get the answer directly. So here we have 5 by 12 and here we have 3 by 8. I'm going to cross multiply. Cross multiply means I'm going to multiply this 8 with 5 okay, and this 12 with 3. So 8 5 is 40 and 12 3 is 36. Now see which number is greater, 40 is greater or 36 is greater. 40 is greater right which means 5 by 12 is greater than 5 by 12 is greater than 3 by 8. It's very simple. If you do the LCM and do it you're gonna get the same answer. If you do in this also you're gonna get the same answer. Which means 5 is to 12 this ratio is greater than 3 is to 8. So it's a simple technique. Whenever you see a one mark type of questions, even two marks, you can do this method. And this method is also correct. Just cross multiply and look at the numerator. Which one is greater? That whole fraction will be greater and the, the ratio will be greater. I hope this question is clear. And in case you have further question or doubt, you can drop a comment. Thank you so much for watching.